Hey everybody, welcome back to Matt's Ice Cream Show. We are back on our quest to, you know, the spill. Today, we're going to be doing Edie's Original Rocky Road Ice Cream. Edie's, also known as Dryers. Uh, Edie's is more in the Midwest and on the East Coast. Dryers is more on the in Texas area and on the West Coast. They're essentially the same company. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and jump into it. Uh, this is actually one of my grandma's favorite ice creams. We always have Edie's in the house. Uh, I would say Edie's is like a average, borderline premium brand. So like I said, today we're going to be doing the Rocky Road. This is uh, chocolate ice cream. I believe it's milk chocolate uh, with marshmallow pieces and almonds. Uh, who, who, who here has had this? Anybody had Edie's in general, but specifically the classic Rocky Road? We did another Edie's before, so make sure to go check out that episode. That was another one of the Rocky Road collection. Um... If you have had ABs and you like it, put it down in the comments below. Let me know what you think. Also, while you're there, make sure to like, share, and subscribe if you like this episode. And please subscribe. It really helps us out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and shut up and get into it. So as you can see, you can see the marshmallows and almonds. Um, not bad. Nice and creamy. Um, out the gate, I would say, um, chocolate isn't bad. What really sticks out the most to me in this is the almonds as of now. It's kind of overpowering. Um, I don't mind almonds or nuts in my ice cream in general, but admittedly, I'm not the biggest fan. There are a few ice creams, but... Or desserts in general, but personally, I could go without. But yeah. So in 1928, William Dreyer and Joseph Eady started their own ice cream thing. They both had ice cream shops before. Uh, William Edie's was really known for candy making. He had a few shops. Um, I'm sorry, Joseph Edie had his own shop. William Dreyer had his own factory of ice cream. They ended up working together and they made their own brand. Hence why... Dryers and Edie's are essentially the same brand. There you go. The uh, ice cream shop, or the ice cream company, is still based out of Oakland, California, I believe. So, I'm not going to eat this whole thing, ellipsis, right now. <laughs> but, it's definitely nice and creamy. Uh, the milk chocolate is kind of like the underlying taste. Um... It's really not that overpowering as far as this goes. To be honest with me, although you can see these large chunks of marsh marshmallows, I don't really get a lot of the marshmallow taste in here. You can kind of taste it a little bit, but between the almonds, the almonds really overpower everything in my opinion. Um, the chocolate, it's not bad chocolate, but it's not very potent. It could be a little bit sweeter in my opinion. This could also be a little denser, a little fattier. I definitely like Edie's. Um, but admittedly, yeah. I feel like this could be a little bit more. Really, it's, it's, it's lacking a bit of fat content in my opinion. Um, it's not bad though. As you guys can see, I'm going to get new shirts, I promise. <laughs> I was originally wearing other shirts when we first started the show, but it was kind of thrown off the camera, specific on the phones, um, when you watch it on the phone. But, so I decided to start wearing solid color shirts, but it's been laundry day forever, and I just haven't gotten around to uh, buying new shirts. Been doing this, guys, to help out with the uh, focusing, focus, 
with the camera. We got a new camera, like I said. But okay, okay, I gotta stop. I gotta stop. It's just so good, and I love ice cream. But like I said, I do wish the chocolate was a little sweeter. It's not even really chocolate forward, you know, like cocoa versus sugar. It's kind of a blander chocolate. Um, the texture is creamy. Um, I do wish it was a little bit more marshmallow too. I mean, there's definitely, the marshmallow is very visible, as you can see. But it's not very potent. Um, scale of 1 to 100, 10 point grading scale. Honestly, you have to give it like an 80, 81. Nothing against this brand, great brand. Dryers and 80s, I'm a big fan of it. But this particular Rocky Road, it's kind of lacking. It's not the most horrible thing I've ever had by any means. However, uh, I'm not going to go out of my way to get this. So, like I said, scale of 1 to 10, probably a, uh, like an 80, 81, 82. It could definitely be better. Um, definitely be better. So, yeah, um, I don't know. Just not as sweet as I would like personally. But anywho, see if you guys can find this. Try it out. Put it down in the comments below. Let me know what you think. And while you're there, what did you think about last ice cream? I thought it was pretty good. Make sure to go check out last ice cream. See if you can find that ice cream. Put it down in the comments of that video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Go try this out. Um, I appreciate my time with you. I really enjoy it. Tell your friends, tell your family. If you're on Instagram, find us on YouTube. If you're on YouTube, find us on Instagram. Have your friends and family come eat ice cream with us every week. We'll be putting the ice cream of the week a few days before it comes out on Instagram. So go check out Instagram. Uh, give me a follow. If you're not already subscribed, please subscribe if you like this video. And even if you don't, press the like button. It really helps me out a lot. Thank you so much for continuing to tune in. And listen to me talk about ice cream. I appreciate uh, you guys listening to me. And thank you so much. And we will see you next time.